Details of the first of three bus service packages under the new government contracting model were released by the Land Transport Authority today. Under the model, the government will own operating assets and decide on bus routes. Residents living in the west of the island will be the first in Singapore to get a taste of bus services under the new government contracting model. And this could come as soon as the second half of 2016. 24 existing bus services and 380 buses originating out of Jurong East, Clementi and Bukit Batok bus interchanges will be the first to come on stream. And while the buses will also operate out of a new bus depot, there will be no change to existing routes. The bus services will largely serve the Jurong East and Bukit Batok areas and comprise 16 under SBS Transit and 8 currently run by SMRT. This is the first of three bus service packages to be tendered out by the LTA over the next two years, with more details of the tender to be revealed at a later date. The government says the new bus contracting model will help make public bus services more responsive to commuter needs and also inject more competition into the industry. Experts say the regions selected for the first services under the new model make sense. Sizable housing units, and it provides uh, uh, some quality employment and uh, educational you know, institutions over here, and as well as the shopping facility. So Jurong area is more like the standalone. So it will be reasonable and expectable for the government to make use of the Jurong area. For private bus operators looking to make a bid, the devil will be in the details. Our main concern is about the content of the uh, tender. Well, what is the requirements, uh, whether we are able to fulfill all the requirements. We are worried about the pricing, uh, how, how they want us to price the thing. Is it a one-off pricing or step-up pricing for the five-year contract? Uh, the next thing we worry about, of course, is definitely the operating costs, oil price, and also the drivers, whether we, are, we can employ enough empl uh, drivers to fill up the vacancies. LTA says details of the second and third bus packages will be announced later. Following last week's announcement on restructuring the public bus industry, there's been some concerns about how the changes would affect workers. The Land Transport Authority says it has been in consultation with bus operators and the National Transport Workers Union. And the Public Transport Tripartite Committee has also been engaging some 800 bus industry workers in dialogue sessions. We have given the assurance that uh, every one of them who is affected by the transition Every one of them whose uh, work uh, is involved in the first tender package and all future packages will be assured of a job. We will require, if there is a new operator that comes on board, this new operator will have to make a job offer to all the affected workers.